hello and welcome back and here we are again in the bathroom we were only in here just a moment ago how strange but anyway today is going to be one of those where this could pretty much go horribly wrong uh, we're gonna redo the old the old hair here so we're gonna reapply blonde to it so the one I bought I'll just show you now so this is the one we're going to be using, it's earlier, I bought this one because it was ammonia free so I thought we'd... In the box you go to applicator, you've got this one and this one which you're going to go into that, that's going to make the uh, formula. This is your aftercare sort of conditioner and obviously a pair of gloves. So basically I'm not going to do the whole thing on camera this time like I did last time because obviously you've pretty much, you know, we've seen how they work and everything. So what I'm going to do is, obviously you can see what my hair is like now, you can see the roots probably there as well. So it's probably going to end up being as patchy as hell if, if it even comes out of the right colour and I don't turn it green or something. Uh, but what I'm going to do is mix it together now um, and then I'll apply it and then come back and sort of show you the results. Nice and quick today. I'm going to show you, although I've not done a very good job of it, this does come with a hole in the box where you can put the bottle, which is supposed to sort of stick in there. I've, I've kind of not made a good job of it, and that's supposed to hold it level. I'm just going to put mine on the top though, because that's just not really worked very well. Right. So the gloves in this are certainly not suitable for, well, pretty much anybody, because they were ridiculously small. Oh, this doesn't look good. Well, it's been on for the time it said, and it doesn't look good. <laughs> so I'm going to wash it off quickly and come back to you. Okay, so there we have it. So my hair's kind of gone like a dark blonde, which I wasn't expecting, but all of the roots are still brown. So it did nothing to those at all. So whether it was my bad application or because it's not got ammonia in it or something it's just not really good enough for dark hair, I don't know, but literally all of my roots <laughs> are still the same colour. It's just basically made what was actually lighter, darker blonde, which is kind of weird. Not sure how that's... I mean, it may change um, once it's dry, it is still wet. Um, so obviously you'll get to see that when it's dried off anyway in uh, future videos, I'm sure. Um, I like the colour, I'm just kind of, I'm just, it's just not, uh, you know, I, th I thought it would do something to the weeds, but literally nothing. So either I didn't get in there, or... It's not very good, good for dark hair, which is kind of, kind of, I mean I just bought a blonde one, maybe I bought something that's made for like more for touching up. Let's have a look, three times more shine, permanent hair colour, no ammonia, pleasant smell, it does smell nice. Uh, light blonde, dark blonde, blonde. So yeah, I think this is just to really change the colour of hair you may already have. So maybe I've not really bought the right thing here, which is why the roots haven't, uh, haven't, yeah, it's not designed for dark hair, which is why it's done nothing to my, to my roots. So it's kind of my fault for ordering the wrong thing, but then why would you buy blonde for blonde hair? I don't really get that, but I like the colour anyway. So yeah, if you've got blonde hair already then, and you want a different blonde, then this is the one to use, it's very good. Um, if you've got dark hair, this is totally useless. Catch you next time. Jet plane headed up to the sky Spread wings and clouds getting